<laughs> Welcome back, guys. Welcome to Maestro Vapes. It's been forever since I shot a video. Usually I try and shoot like one a week at least. And it's been a couple of weeks since my last one, all right? So I wanted to shoot a quick one just to show you something, okay? It's written in the description below right now. It's the Captain Cap from Amerivape, okay? This is the Modman Green version. And I, I didn't think too much about it. Like the first run came out months and months and months ago and i just thought okay cool it's you know a little add-on it has the av logo on it and whatever you know cool i don't want one you know but ended up getting one and i couldn't be more pleased i have two tugboats i have two version one tugboats that were kind of like i dig my ver my black anodized version one tugboat and i use it a lot like the monster tiger coil build that i did you know a few months back like it's been like three months is still living in this like i'm still vaping off of it and it is boss as all shit okay um but i got this cap and i just looked at it and i thought okay it's got like this four and a half mil what's that like 11 60 fourths if i'm wrong then it's written somewhere in here but i got that and it's like it looks kind of silly you know i thought it looked kind of big because i've always been a fan of really small kind of you know one and a half mil air holes and have a bunch of them you know i just felt like there's more resistance you get a better vape out of it but this thing has proved me wrong like it's really freaked me out and i've learned a lot by using it you know so i wanted to share it with you and show it to you okay um and right now it's kind of funny because i don't even have it on my manhattan I've got it on an H Cigar Oros clone. Um, I might do a video for this. It works really well. If you see an H Cigar Oros clone out there, I got it for like 42 bucks, okay? So it's pretty cheap and it works well. But this cap just breathed a new life into my tugboat. Like I was digging my tugboat. I was getting great flavor out of my tugboat. And I drilled it out to about three millimeter holes on either side, just three mil holes that's it and I was vaping it and I was really digging it but with these holes it just opens it up and gives you it changes your addy like it changes your addy completely and I really really dig it so if some of you guys have a tugboat out there and maybe it's collecting dust or you don't use it as much as you normally would have when you first got it try this thing out man it is slick like Rick with a big dick man You get a killer vape off of it. You can blow sick clouds and the flavor is still there. Like it's still there and it weirds me out, man. Like it's awesome. It changed my tugboat completely, okay? I'm gonna drip a couple more drops on here. Now, the thing about this top cap is it's big. Like it is pretty big and thick. So, if you're gonna try and use it on a 22 millimeter mod, 23 millimeter mod, it's gonna look kind of goofy. Like it's gonna be a lot bigger, but if you're using it on something like your Oros, you're using it on your Manhattan, Skyline, Apollo, stuff like that, it's gonna be pretty decent, okay? But if you take it and put it on your Nemi, it's gonna look kind of goofy. So keep that in mind because I believe it's 25 millimeter, in diameter and I've been enjoying vaping it here let me take this thing off and you can see the diameter of it because it is pretty big so if you look at the bottom of that guy that's my tugboat in there and it just hangs off the lip of that big time, okay? It really does. I'm like gleaming light onto you right now. <laughs> but yeah, it just works, man. And if you look at it, you open it up. I'm going to put it back on. It doesn't look too much different than my tugboat cap. Like it doesn't have a conical shape to it, nothing like that. It looks very similar to the inside of my tugboat cap. 
It really truly does. But the airflow and just the way that it works, it might be a little bit more shallow actually, but it works so well. So, so well. Um, drip tips, you can use drip tips if you want. I just choose not to. With the knurled edge, it's kind of nice to just tailpipe this thing. This is probably one of the nicest caps to tailpipe that I've used so far. That's why I'm gushing about it so much. Um, all of my 510 drip tips, though, that I put into this fit. So let's say, you know, I want to put that tip in. I could. Great flavor, man. Great, great flavor. What do I got? Another, like, palm drip tip. Put that thing in there. Looks pretty dope, actually. Stubby stubby tips look really cool on this too. I wish I had one in front of me to show you right now. But if you buck this thing down like a third of the size of it, it looks really sharp, man. What? What? It's so good. Um, but yeah, it kind of freaked me out a little bit. Those airflow holes are that big that I didn't think that there was going to be any resistance to my draw. And there really is a ton of it. So I've been digging it a lot. Um, I got it from my homeboys at Dash Vapes. Check them out. Pretty cool beans, man. Pretty, pretty cool beans. Vaping uh, frosting up in this. Um, frosting from Halcyon Vapors. And it's boss, man. If you've been thinking about picking up a captain's cap, check one out man you will not be disappointed if you like an airy draw like i do and busting out some clouds off of it decent flavor like it works man tugboat was a great atomizer this makes it better okay that's all i got nice short quick video it was cool to see you guys uh the next video i'm going to be posting is going to be the battle of the boxes so look out for that it is going to be cool as a fan, my friends, okay? So I'll catch you on that one. Butt out, vape up, breathe easy, know your limits and vape within it, and you are going to have a stellar day, all right? Catch you on the next one. What a fantastic vape.